Series yeah. Best Mix, 107.5, Cool FM. And there's Alicia Karen and Wild Things at 708. It's Dale and Charlie on a sunny Thursday with a high climate of 16. We're sitting at 8 right now. Ah, warming up a little bit. Yeah. And even if we didn't have sunshine outside, we have sunshine. Oh, man, what a smooth talker. What was, the last like time you, what was the last time you had a lady sweet talk to you like that? Uh -huh. Holy you man. Learn a little I don't bit. think it's. I don't think I've ever had a lady sweet talk me. <laughs> wow. Well, you know, you're young. You know, give yeah. It time. Yeah. And we do. We have Aiden in from uh, Innisdale Secondary. Uh, hey. hey. Yeah. <laughs> oh my God, this kid's awesome. <laughs> and uh, we're here to talk about uh, just a fantastic thing um, that you did for one of your classmates a couple of weeks ago. Um, well, he's actually not one of my classmates. He's one of the classmates from next door over. Okay. Okay. So why don't you explain what uh, what happened? <clears throat> just kind of a broad sense. Well, I'm coming out of Woodshop, and naturally, there are like six or seven kids who decide to pick on this one kid coming out. Okay. And so I naturally stood up for him and said, hey, this is my friend, stop picking on him. So, he, so the bully said, well, if he's your, if he's your friend, then uh, hug him. And so I did, just to spite them. Nice. Well, there you go. well done. So, what was their reaction afterwards without, like, not repeating? Just kind of like surprised like, that you actually right? did it. Like complete shock. Okay. And, and then was, they. I, that was basically the end of it then? That was the end of it. And to my knowledge, they haven't picked on him since. Oh, that's fantastic. And sometimes that's all it takes because sometimes a lot of these kids, you know, kids are kids and kids are mean and it's part of learning. Kids will be kids. And they don't actually realize what they're doing really until maybe somebody like you puts them in their place. And uh, this all sparked from the mother of that kid that was being picked on, and she was just so overjoyed by how wonderful you were. She tried to find your mom, because that's what moms do. We like to praise each other and help each other out. And oh my God, where's Aiden's mom? And uh, she found you, and then we were able to find you too. And it's just, it's an incredible story. And I, I know there are a lot of kids like Aiden out there, but we wanted to highlight your story because it just seemed like such a, a really nice thing. Because there was a group of kids. This wasn't just one kid picking on one kid. There was a, there was a lot of them there, right? Yeah. Yeah. So. And it, it was, uh, yeah. It, 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 it is a good story. It is a good story. So you're you're in, it was a shop class you were coming at? It was wood shop. Okay, so let's talk about that for a second. Because yeah. Charlie has memories of Woodshop that are far different than most people's. So being in Woodshop, I mean, you, are you digging that course? Is that fine? Yeah, it's a really good course. Okay, cool. So what can you make? Can you make stuff? Um, well, you can only make what you what you are allowed to make at the moment. Okay, what are they sure. letting you make? Yeah. Well, right now we're working on Muskoka tricks. Oh, wow. See, that's something very worthwhile. Well, that is cool. That's great, man. See, that's the kind of thing I like, sitting around in the Muskoka chair. I know. I tried to make a table, but it's like the wrong side. So are you. you. Learn a little. <laughs> <laughs> no, my chair is going to be a bit lost side too, so. <laughs> we can learn a little something from Aiden. That's fantastic. So you're in grade nine. How are you uh, How are you liking high school so far? Well, it's pretty good so far. Okay, so you didn't think anything of it. Just you were I sticking didn't, out honestly. for this kid. You just saw something. It wasn't right, and you, were, you had to fix it. Yeah. That's the long and the short of it. Okay. All right. Well, you know what? Hang tight for a second because yeah. we got a couple more questions we want to ask you, but we got to get some traffic in here. Very so Best Max 107.5. Cool FM Dan Tulevsky. Knock me off my feet. 721. It's Dale, Charlie, and Aiden, who's joining us this morning. Aiden Kane, who is uh, just in here because uh, did something really cool. Stood up, said no to bullying. Somebody was being picked on by some kids in a stale secondary school. Said, hey, it's my friend, man. And that was the end of that. Put them in their place. Yeah, well, it works out. Works out, works out good. And uh, and it's nice to have you in here and talking about all these kind of things. You know, I know it's only grade nine. Any ideas what you think you'd like to do for a living? I mean, you know, um, I don't four know. years of high school are gonna fly by, man. I think I'm kind of edging towards being maybe a singer or such. Yeah. Really? So yeah. do you play an instrument? Uh, I don't play an instrument. My voice is my instrument. Oh. Okay. Do you want to learn how to play the guitar? I am really edging to learn how to play the guitar. You My dad actually has a 12-string guitar at home that he inherited. Nice. You, oh, you, could okay. be, you could be like Mick Jagger, primarily a singer <laughs> who likes to try to play the guitar. Well, <laughs> I like to try, but I fail miserably. You know what, though? One day, oh, you'll I'm just crying. get it. And maybe you just, maybe you just need your own guitar. Maybe that's it. Like, you got your dad, but maybe you need your own that you can name and, you know, that can be yours. Well, we could probably try and build one in wood shop. You like, could. That would be or, pretty cool. That actually might be pretty cool. Or, 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 or we, we could give you one. 
So here's what happened. Again, we've got, uh, you know, Jim called um, from downtown. He's a local shop owner, of course. Wants to get Mantiques. Antiques. Mantiques. What a pair. I like the sound of that. But also, you may be familiar with Park Place. Uh -huh. uh, Maple View in the 400. And, uh, well, the good folks at Park Place heard your story. And this travels fast. It <laughs> does. And, I mean, that's a, Park Place is a big place. And there are a lot of stores. And they all came together yesterday and pulled an insane prize pack for you. So Park Place has stepped up and is giving you a guitar. Sports Clip is giving you a uh, gift card so you can look stylish whenever you want. Most of the restaurants, um, Teriyaki, Panera, Lone Star, The Sweet Oven, all stepping up with gift cards for you. Park Place itself is giving you a bunch of swag. Cabela's has stepped in. If you like to fish, they've given you a fishing rod and some swag. Uh, Sport Check has stepped in. Best Buy has stepped in. All to say, Aiden, you really are the coolest kid ever. Wow. You guys on the, you guys listening to this can't can't see my expression, but I'm like I can't stop myself from smiling. He is right just now. grinning from ear wanna, to ear. I want to look at the guitar in the corner. I know we've got it. We were it hiding right it behind here. Ellie. And uh, yeah, they've stepped up with uh, just an incredible um, prize pack for you because, you know. Such swag. Th this will, you know, maybe motivate. Let's take a look and see what kind of a guitar you're getting. To say, you know what, sometimes not saying something. Now remember, I don't know if you want to let dad play this. <laughs> wow. Look at that. What do you think? Well, there you go, man. Can I take it out? Yeah. yeah. It's yours. It's yours. <laughs> You can, you know, so I want you, when you become famous. Yeah, don't forget about us, all right? Just who gave you your first guitar besides Park Place? It was Dale and Charlie. That's right. Go ahead. What do you think? This is awesome. That Ready is to go. hardcore. Thank you guys so much. No, thank you for uh, for being an inspiration. Hopefully everybody listening, uh, I told my kids yeah. about this story. Yeah. And if you just relay this message, just, just point out that yeah. sometimes yeah. if you see something... Uh, that just doesn't look right, even just saying a little something, standing next to the kid, giving him a hug like yeah. Aiden did, that's all it takes. I told my wife about it, and she said, that's great, now that doesn't get you out of doing the dishes, it's still your job. So. <laughs> the world needs more hugs. Yeah. That's right. Right. There Aiden. you go, and that's the way it ends. Well, Thanks. thank you so much for coming for in. For coming in, man. We appreciate it, Aiden. It's, uh, it's great I, to meet you. It is an honor to be on here. Wow. That's nice. Like, never in my life I would have imagined being on Cool FM. Well, hey, there's a first for everything, and this is this is your your first, uh, you know, star moment, and no doubt you will have many others. Yeah. Yeah. So close, Shia LaBeouf, nothing is impossible. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we got a little music. We're gonna come back because you want to hear Owl City and Fireflies. Mm -hmm. All right, well, let's let's do, just, let's do that right now then on Barry's 107.5 Cool FM.